<laughs> now all you need to do is take some tape and tape it at the parts where they connect. Like this. Junior class! Bismillahirrahmanirrahim! Assalamualaikum, friends. It's me, a baby. <laughs> Don't mind me. I was just wondering if you've ever noticed how our chest moves when we breathe. Oh, take a look. When I breathe in, my chest goes up. And when I breathe out, my chest goes down. Whoa, interesting, right? <laughs> MashaAllah. Let's take a closer look, shall we? Science time with a baby. That's me. <laughs> Today, we're going to learn about the respiratory system. The respiratory system's main job is to move fresh air into our bodies while removing waste gases like carbon dioxide out of our body. Whoa! And the main organ of the respiratory system is the lungs. Yeah! Other respiratory organs are the nose, the trachea, and breathing muscles like the diaphragm. <laughs> And lucky for us, I have a model of our respiratory system right here. <laughs> so now we can see how it all works. Yeah! As you can see here, the straw is the trachea where the air goes in. And the balloons are the lungs. And the blue part at the bottom is the diaphragm, which we've said is one of the breathing muscles. And now we can see how it all works together. <laughs> When we breathe in through our mouth and nose, air will enter through the trachea, which is this part right here. And then, the diaphragm will contract and pull downwards, increasing the space in the chest cavity so that our lungs will expand. See? Whoa, take a look at that. The balloons, which are our lungs, is getting bigger. Wow! MashaAllah! And when we breathe out, the diaphragm relaxes, Ooh, which decreases the space in the chest cavity, which then deflates our lungs. Whoa. Air, at the same time, will leave through the trachea and will exit through our mouth and nose as well. <laughs> Interesting, right? Yeah! Let's see it again. Breathe in, Ooh, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. <laughs> Cool, right? Yeah! What's that? You want to learn how to make one? <laughs> of course I'll teach you! Now, to make your very own respiratory system model, here are some materials that you'll need. <laughs> a bottle, a bottle cap, a pair of scissors, some straws, some balloons, some modeling clay, and some tape. But before we begin, we must always say, Bismillah! <laughs> Alright, let's get started! Ooh. First, you take a bottle and you use the scissors, but be careful, make sure there's always a grown-up to help you when you use a pair of scissors. <laughs> okay? Great! Then, you cut the bottle in half and it should look something like this. Ooh. Now you can put it to the side and next, all you have to do is poke a hole through the bottle cap, like this. But make sure the hole is big enough for you to fit a straw through it. <laughs> Great! And next, take a couple of straws like this, and you should cut it right about here, right about the middle, like this. Bismillah. Oh, wow! And then, we'll cut it right about here. <laughs> next, all you have to do is take the two straws and you fit them together into the straw that you cut, like this. Ah! Once you put the straws together, it should look something like this. <laughs> now all you need to do is take some tape and tape it at the parts where they connect, like this. <laughs> it doesn't have to be perfect, so don't worry. <laughs> And even if the straw is a bit longer, you can adjust it at a later time. <laughs> it's easier to have a longer straw which you can cut it to short instead of a short straw where you can't make it longer. <laughs> so it should be something like that. Yeah. 
Next, we'll put this to the side, and it's time to cut some balloons. Woohoo! So over here, we've got some some balloons. Two red ones and one blue one. We're gonna be using the two red ones for our lungs. So to make the lungs, you'll have to cut the balloon closer to the top. Be careful! Woohoo! It's sharp. One down. One to go. A tip is to stretch out the balloon so it's easier to cut. See? <laughs> Our lungs. <laughs> now we'll put this to the side and it's time to cut the diaphragm. For the diaphragm, you need to cut it lower, around the round part of the balloon. Like here. And then cut it. Whoa. Next, take the diaphragm and wrap it at the bottom of the part of the bottle where you cut. And once you've wrapped the balloon at the part where you cut the bottle, it's time to tape it like this so that it's nice, tight, and secure. Yeah! Now we can put this to the side and it's time to put our lungs to the straws. <laughs> like this. So we take each balloon and we'll put it on each fork right here. One on this side and then We'll tape it, like this. And we'll do the same at the other side. <laughs> and once you've taped your balloons, it should look something like this. Wow! Yeah! Next, you take the bottle cap with the hole, <laughs> and then you put the straw through just like this. Wow! <laughs> Once you put the straw through, all you have to do is take some clay and stick it at the top so that air can enter through the hole that you made, like this. Just put it right on top there. Oh, it's really sticky. Whoa. Just like that. And it should look something like that. Yeah! And once you're done, you'll take the bottle and fit the balloon through the hole like this. Ah. <laughs> yeah. And there you have it. Your very own respiratory system model. Oh, let's see if it works. Bismillah. Whoa. <laughs> cool, right? Alhamdulillah. We learned so much about the respiratory system today. <laughs> I hope you had fun as much as I did. Wow. And I hope that you can manage to make your own respiratory system model back at home. <laughs> and if you want, you can also show me by tagging us at the Instagram handle below. <laughs> well, until I see you again next time, may Allah bless our day. <laughs> Assalamualaikum. Bye. <laughs> hey there, let's go to Dario Plus. Whee! Ooh.